out to hunt for midday set. It's 10 o'clock. You know, I'm about a mile from where I'm going in at. Justin with PhD TV. It's November 9th, 2024. It's about 10 15 in the morning. It's raining all morning pretty heavy this morning, so I decided to stay at the house and eat breakfast and come out right after it's calmed down on the rain. Um, driving in was pretty exciting. Saw a lone doe out in the field, and about a mile more down the road, once I turned off on gravel, a, a buck courting a doe out in the cut corn. Nice looking buck. I'll I'm sure I'll have a picture of him up here. And then uh, after I got done gawking at those two, drove about two more miles down the gravel road, about a mile away from where I'm sitting right now, and look off in another field, and sure enough, there's a little bit smaller of a buck first one, but decent nonetheless, with about any doe walk down in the middle of the field as well. It's kind of funny, because when I first spotted them, they were both standing up, and as I turned the corner and started getting closer, the buck, it almost looked like he kind of got down and tried to hide from me, while the doe just stood there and watched me. I think he, he realized his, his cover was blown, and they got up and took off, but yeah, so once I got parked and got everything ready to walk in. I started walking in and about 50 yards from the truck, I looked to the east and in the timber and there's a nice, probably real tall, tall eight pointer, I'd say mainframe eight, watching me walk in. He was probably 150 to 125 yards away. I text Colt and told him, yeah, if it was rifle season right now, he'd be dead. It's the evening of November the 9th. We're out here still on Doe Patrol. As far as I know, Justin hasn't had any luck. He's about 50 miles to the west of here hunting. He was doing a midday step, midday sit. I'm not sure what time he was getting out. So, anyhow, we're back in the saddle. Got my daughter here, that's Andrea. Hopefully she's my lucky charm. She's only been out with me a handful of times, so it'd be nice to harvest something with her. So that way she can see the process and how much work it takes and uh, see if she wants to do it eventually or not. So, All right, I'm going to turn the camera around and hopefully November 9th is the day.